So I have this all redone. This 10 by 10 plastic shed. Because I'm moving all the birds to this side. Tomorrow. So all of my birds sleep right there in a pile. And Chilo sleeps in front of the heater, which is right back there. Hi, guys. Nobody's where they usually are, but that's okay. Looks like it's going to be a little bit tight. The ducks are going upstairs in the loft. I don't know if I'll put a couple chickens up there. Hey, babies. What you doing, babies? Everybody being nice to you in there? Most of the time, they're nice to the babies. Not always. So our winter storm has already started. But it's not going to... It's going to get down to... Uh, what was it? 26, 27, 28 tonight? That's not so bad. So I'm not doing it... I'm turning the heat lamp off. But when it gets below zero... The heat lamp will not be turned off at all. It'll be on until it warms up. I added a string of lights that are not LED. Blue is the only ones I could find. So they've got this base. Let me see if I can find. Yep, that's what I was looking for. So they'll have this space, then there's space underneath the shelf in the front. There's spaces for the chickens to hide. Place to put their dishes. And the food's in here and the water will be in here. We're almost out of bedding again. I kept a fence in here in case I have to fence somebody off. But there's places for them to go under, on. Keep a slot bucket in here to keep the somewhere to put the dirty water. There's the shelf. They can go underneath the shelf. So they have this much space. That's the flap that goes down. So they'll have a 10 by 10 space. It's not perfect, but when it gets down to 20 below, zero, it is, uh, it's going to hit the spot to have everything and everybody in one spot. There's a heater in the loft. There's a heater downstairs. And there's the light. The heat light lamp. And then there's the Christmas lights. Which will just, you know, make it less gloomy. And they do give off some heat. So I guess tomorrow... I will shoo all the birds out of this space and put this flap down just so that they're not going back over here because I'm not going to be using this. This side will be unplugged completely. And we will only be powering this side. And we do have a generator. It is possible our power will go out. The generator was started recently and gassed up and we have extra gas. So we're ready. All the snacks are over here. Everything I need is inside this space. So I'm going to turn off the lights and we're out of here. Christmas lights aren't showing up on film. That's too bad. This is bungeed to the fence and tied down. I mean, it always is. It's supposed to get 40 mile an hour winds. It's going to be like this tomorrow, too. We're having a weather event before the next weather event, which is just cold. Lots and lots of cold. Christmas lights are on. So the only Christmas lights that are left out here, are the, <coughs> oh, excuse me, are the solar. And the greenhouse Christmas lights will be unplugged tomorrow because I have to plug in a bigger heater so everything else gets unplugged. <laughs>